Okay, let's vlog the aftermath on my phone because I didn't bring my camera. I'm so sad. But guys, it was so nice meeting with you. I'm like half happy that I didn't vlog, you know, because I would be like worrying about like vlogging when I really should just be like spending time with you guys. And it was so fun. And these were like the little leftover like goodie bags and they spelled dough. Dough it was so nice that they like did this whole little meetup for us. Like <laughs> they're putting the place back together now because this is all full with chairs and we had like a panel up there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Work out so well because like we're so close out. <laughs> and then we had like pizza and stuff up there and we took a bunch of pictures and it was so fun it went so well and it was so nice meeting you guys we love Dote's new office because I know we showed their old one but now there's way more space in this one it's really cool and it was just so nice meeting you guys that came like thank you so much for coming out some people that drove like an hour and a half or two hours or like one girl was from she flew here but she was coming here anyway but she was from like Chicago or like Iowa Iowa, Iowa. Iowa. Like, thank you. That means Chicago, the world. Chicago, Oregon. <laughs> Same thing. But it was so fun meeting everyone. And I'm sorry if I'm a zombie. We literally got back from the airport. Tasha had her, like, hour flight. I had, like, my six-hour flight. We, like, get to Lee's house, throw down our stuff. I put on an outfit that doesn't match and really doesn't go together. I'm probably not even filming my face right now. Whatever. And we, like, run to the park. And we, we didn't really say like where we were going to be in the park because Tasha and I thought it was going to be like a little park mm -hmm. and it was like really big. And so then everyone said that they were just looking for two blonde girls. <laughs> That's us. <laughs> if you could see my makeup right now, well you can and this is not a pretty sight. And I'm really sorry that vlogging at the meetup was a total fail. But like I said when I was on my iPhone when we were there at the end, it was good to just focus on everyone that was there, you know? Contrary to popular belief, I am wearing clothes right now, just like minimal. Tasha's and I, Tasha's and I milkshakes. Tasha's and my milkshakes bring all the boys to the yard. Tasha, <laughs> Tasha and I order milkshakes and they are on the way. And guess where they're from? Guess where they're from? This really gourmet new restaurant. You guys wanna hear what it's called? It's really a secret. It's called Mickey D's. And, um, <laughs> Um, I was talking about how really cute my eyeliner looks in this lighting. Can't you see where my fake eyelashes ripped off all the eyeliner? Love when that happens. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore because I'm so overtired because I haven't slept in like two days. So yeah, that's how today's going. But the meetup was so fun and I'm so happy we got to meet everyone and you're all so nice. And some of you, I just felt like we've been friends forever already. Okay, love you, bye. Good morning, everyone. <laughs> my voice sounds like this every morning when I wake up because that's just me. Who else is like that? But I literally woke up 30 seconds ago, so I thought, let's just keep it real and start vlogging right now. And I know I wear this shirt in every vlog. I told Tasha, I think one time I forgot that I wore it like three days in a row and I kept vlogging in it, so who else doesn't wear clothes like a bunch of days in a row, you know? But now we're getting ready to go to work. And I'm excited because I didn't even vlog yet at work today, but here's our little room we've been working in. There's our cute little messages from yesterday. And now we're going on our lunch break. Hi, Taco. You remind me of um Teddy. <laughs> Forgets dog's name. Oh. So right now we're at coffee bar on our little lunch break. It's really cute. It gives me like Earth vibes a little bit. <laughs> it's funny that the wind's so strong. Your leaf flew off your salad. <laughs> so Tasha and I just left work. We took some really cute pics. We just posted them on Insta and now we're going to the Reformation store because Reformation's on dope and we're going to try to get some cute content in here. Hopefully we don't get yelled at. Tasha, I didn't tell you, when me and Kate were doing an Instagram live in Italy, cute, they got really mad at us and they made us stop. So hopefully it's not like that. <laughs> Guys, we just got to Reformation and it's like their showroom. So basically you like pick out a piece and you're like, oh, I want this in like a size four. And then they grab it for you and like put it in a room for you and these... Dressing rooms are so cool. Like what? So I just got in mine and it's like literally like a room, like not like a dressing room. It's like closed off, you know what I mean? And then right here it says, find your light, plug in your music and let your mirror face run wild. And it looks like you can like change the lighting or something. Seriously, how cute is this place? Like what? And she's like all the items you picked are in your wardrobe. Okay, let's try it out. No way. It like changes the lighting, did you see that? Basic. This is basic. That was cool what we just had. I like cool. It's like chill vibes. It's like very blue. Golden is what we started off with. It must just be kind of like orangey. Yep. And then sexy time. 
Ooh, it's like just the mirror light and not the like top ones anymore. This place is so cool. I literally can plug in my phone and play music like to dry the clothes too. That's so funny. Like you have like a little fashion show in here. You're like, you can practice your walk. <laughs> I'm gonna try and close now and stop being weird, but basically everyone needs to copy Reformation because this dressing room is like an experience. Oh, and she said that I could like play around on here, I think. <gasps> no way, it's like touch screen TV or something. These jeans I wanted. And I think if I click try it on, she like comes and brings it to me. Oh, it's like literally like their website in here. You can like see stuff. Oh my God, this place is so cool. Reformation, you're doing your dressing rooms very well. And everyone should take a lesson from you. 10 out of 10, actually. 11 out of 10. Wait, oh my god. I need this dress. How flipping cute is that? Especially with those little espadrilles. Guys, this top is exactly what I've been looking for ever since Lucy and I saw um, Romy. Is that her name? The Victoria's Secret model. She just started a YouTube channel. Her videos were so cute. We watched her vlogs and she was wearing a white button up like this. I was really like relaxed looking and she just had some like layered gold necklaces and they were so cute. So I'm for sure getting this because it just Love this, but I want it in green, and I'm definitely getting this. I want to give you off of the day. These are from Zara, and then this tank top is from Salt Boutique in Nantucket. And I showed it in a recent haul video if you want to know the brand, because I forget what it is. But yeah. All right, guys, so me and Tasha, we really messed up and thought that it started at 9, but it started at 8. So now we realize, because we just started an hour late, that Eric didn't make it, but we both thought that it was gonna be Peter or Brian anyway. And all of our friends over on the East Coast already know. So my phone has been on airplane mode for the past like 20 minutes, and it's gonna stay that way for the next two hours because I don't wanna know, so yeah. Rachel looks so pretty. She's in such good shape. I always notice her arms. Her arms are so nice. Arm goals, guys. And I just got out of the shower and I still didn't brush my hair. And whose hair looks like this once they get out of the shower? Like it's always in like rat's nest and I have to like rip through it with a brush, so that's fun. And I dumbly signed up for Soul Cycle at 7 a.m. When we're gonna be staying up till like midnight watching this, but oh well. I guess once you guys see this, it'll be after. So how do you feel about it? How it goes down? We both think we know who we want to win, but who's gonna win. Like we think that Brian's gonna win, but we want Peter to win. I think Brian yeah. is a snake. Because when it seems too good to be true, ladies and gentlemen, is because it is too good to be true. <laughs> because we think that he'll just be like a loser. Is that a scary preview? Oh my god. Wait, I have seen a preview, but it's not scary. Whoa, that just like pulled me in. <laughs> Boo! <laughs> Tasha and I are pissed. I'm I just think so he's fake. Sad. I think he's fake. This is literally what we predicted. We were like, we want Peter to win. We think Brian's gonna win. And Brian, well not wins, like they're engaged. You know what I mean? I feel like it's weird. It's like, he won. <sighs> like I've always liked Brian, but Peter's supposed to be your husband. <gasps> I'm upset. Oh my God, this is a scary commercial. I'm scared, I'm scared. Oh. <laughs> we were saying that their engagement felt too like, do you guys know what I mean? Who's with us? Leave your comments down below. It felt too like, it felt like really rehearsed and just like they're both so happy. He was like, ah, "You're my fiance!" Like, "Ah, you're my, you're my fiance!" I'm so excited! Wow! And like neither of them was like crying or anything. Like I remember with Sean and Catherine's engagement, Catherine was like, <sighs> I feel like she was like freaking out. Like I feel like it should be like, like that. For both of them, it's not really like an engagement. It's more like, oh, we're gonna be dating after this. Yeah. But it's like we have like the title and the ring. Yeah, I agree. We thought the connection with Peter was deeper. And watching Peter with her was so rough. I was literally about to cry the whole time. Like he was crying and he's like, I'm still in love with her. And I'm like, oh my gosh, how freaking sad. But I mean, hopefully her and Brian are like happy ever after, you know? She deserves it. And that's another thing. I think because she's had so many boyfriends now and like with Nick and everything, like she's just like, okay, time to get engaged. Peter's such a cutie. Peter, call me. <laughs> We're like a little young, but that's okay. <laughs> I'm ready to get married like yesterday, so. Oh my God, you're insane. I'm literally 20, but I'm just like, me and Taylor like live through The Bachelor and The Bachelorette. Like, we like can't wait to get married. I feel like the show puts out a lot of like unrealistic expectations. Not like I feel like, like I know it does. It does. But anyway, yeah. I'm gonna get married at 24 and Tasha's gonna get married at 44. Never. Oh yeah, guys, leave your comments down below of like gossip you've heard and just like, cause I wanna know we're interested in that. And just like what, how you feel about it because we have lots of feelings. But like, I still like Brian. I always thought he was cute. And he's like, I like how he treats Rachel because he's really nice to her. But it seems too good to be true. And we think that it is. But I guess it's not. Good morning, guys. I am going to school cycle right now. 
So excited. Just got back from Soul Cycle. I'm living up to my basic self. Look what I got. Oh my god, bye. I got a green juice next door on my way out because I was like, might as well start off the day extra healthy. And I don't think I've had this one before. It's just the greens one. It only has kale, spinach, romaine, parsley, cucumber, lemon, and celery. So there's like no fruit. So it really just tastes like vegetables, which tastes really healthy. But I like when there's like banana in it because then it's like sweet. So it's not that sweet. But yeah, basically it was a really good experience here. I went with, it was so good. His music was really good. Camille, go to Camille in Soma. And I gotta stop talking and get ready because we have to leave in like half an hour. So I gotta shower and get ready really quick. Look at him with all of our packages. <laughs> we love you, Peter. Oh my gosh, he's so cute. He comes in every day with like handfuls of packages that Tosh and I have gotten. <laughs> so Tosh and I are just in the back room right now doing some work and we just got lunch. They literally get catered lunch every day. It's like so ideal because then I feel like you stay in the mindset. Like a week, they didn't uh, yesterday. Oh, you're right. They didn't. They didn't. I feel like the week. Oh, there's popcorn on my face still. I feel like the week that we came before, they literally yeah. had it every day. But um, I think it's good because then you like stay in the mindset of like the workplace, you know. I don't know. And then everyone can like eat together and it's like, it's like when you're at school and you like bring lunch. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, we've just been doing some work all morning. <laughs> she put it in general. Daughters who are members of Bachelor Nation, check out latest Instagram posts. Tasha and I just posted the funniest post that Tasha found of this tweet last night when we watched the Bachelor finale and it was like, when you order something online versus what actually comes and we posted that on Instagram because we thought it was really funny. So yeah, I got this new shirt from Urban. Love it. It was out of stock in my size, but I just want to size up and it still fits. Woo we might go check out the filming room upstairs because there's a bunch of like little side rooms off of like the main space like out there and so one upstairs we're like oh this can be like a total like content like filming room they got one ring light and then they got like studio lights like the same ones i have and then we're gonna like play around with that film some videos so guys tosh and i left work here are all the clothes that came today at dope for me that i ordered for beauty con because i just really don't know what i want to wear yet and we went to everlane got some content for dope and then we are on our way to reformation and we saw sobla Bless you. I was gonna say it before you sneeze. So we are on our way to Reformation because I need to get this white top that I tried on yesterday. That's right, so lucky because we came here before with Tasha's old roommate and it was so fun and so good. Their fries were like the best fries we ever had. So then we walked into Reformation and we just saw it and we were like, hey, like let's just come here and get the fries for a little snack. And I told Tasha I love like Mike at the ice cream. Thank you. Thank you. Best fries ever. Oh yeah, I was telling Tasha that like. My favorite thing is when you like have a plan and you're going somewhere with someone, but then you find like a cute little like place to stop into for a snack or like a drink or like I don't know. It's just like fun because you're just like living in the moment type of thing. I don't know. That sounds fun. 